Welcome to our World of Fiery videos, covering topics of everyday importance to print providers. Today we will cover importance of calibration. So, what is calibration? Well, if you look at companies or industry, or in this case, an institution called um, International Color Consortium, there is a definition of calibration that falls into a process that measures or adjusts the color response of a device, in, in this case a fiery connected printer, to a known state. And really what that means is you're adjusting the color output to take into consideration things like paper type or humidity or temperature or color gamut or color space of the device that you're printing with. And calibration really is a key functionality of the fiery controller. And I thought I'd exemplify this a little bit more visually with what calibration is by saying, first of all, this is what we consider color consistency. When we talk about calibration in terms of a connected digital front end, the fiery controller, we're saying this is what gives you color consistency. Another way to look at this is, you know, really why do you need calibration? I want to show you that if we have, in this case, what looks to be a bullseye and these little black dots, let's say, represent the same print job printed seven times. If you have an uncalibrated output or uncalibrated system, you will get color, but it certainly is not going to look or has the potential not to look similar to one another. When you calibrate, in this case, say, for example, we've calibrated using the firing, what you get is a much more consistent output, meaning that now all the pages look very close to one another. And for the vast majority of users, consistency and having that ability to reproduce the same colors day in and day out is pretty much all people really want. What I do want to tell you, though, is that above and beyond just being able to calibrate and give you consistency, the Fiery DSE plus some of our options like Color Profiler Suite, for example, allows you to do something unique. It allows you to go in and thumbprint a color workflow that is may be very demanding, something that you have to match exactly or try to match as close as possible. For example, a printing press or another type of output on a particular paper stock. What happens is when you start to use calibration on a consistent basis, you create a foundation for being able to do one other thing, and that is to profile. And when you're able to profile, which is simply, it's essentially again kind of doing a custom thumbprint of a particular workflow for color, you get the ability to have calibration and profiling to drive a higher level of accuracy. So when you look at the bullseye, you've got consistency, which a lot of people are happy with, but if you want consistency and accuracy, the highest recommended workflow for color is to calibrate and profile. So where do you find calibration? Well, one of the areas is under Job Center. So if you launch Command Workstation and you click the Job Center tab, one of the buttons that shows up in the bar is Calibrate. That's one way to get to it. The other way, which is Device Center, when you click on Device Center, you click Tools, you'll find the Calibrate button there as well. Thank you for watching. For additional resources and e-learning classes on this topic, visit our website. To see all recorded sessions and register for upcoming World of Fiery webinars, please visit efi.com forward slash WOF webinars.